So firstly, what is Bitcoin? What makes it unique? And are those characteristics still valid? Let's go back to the very beginning. What is Bitcoin? Bitcoin, or BTC, is a cryptocurrency, a virtual currency designed to act as money and a form of payment outside the control of any one person, group, or entity. This removes the whole layer of third-party middlemen involved in financial transactions. However, Bitcoin is not just a virtual currency, but also a store of value, much like gold, silver, or platinum. Bitcoin was introduced to the public in 2009 by an anonymous developer or group of developers using the name Satoshi Nakamoto. Bitcoin is unique in that its transactions are immutable, so they can't be deleted. Bitcoin is censorship resistant, has a capped supply, and is decentralized, so no one entity, government, person, or group can control it. These are some of the factors that makes Bitcoin unique and sets it apart as a unique asset class called digital assets. Of course, since Bitcoin has become the most well-known cryptocurrency in the world, it has inspired the development of many other cryptocurrencies. These competitors have either attempted to replace it as a payment system or are used as utility or security tokens in other blockchains and emerging financial technologies. But why would you want to invest in Bitcoin? What makes Bitcoin unique? Number one, Bitcoin separates money supply from the government. We see this situation currently in the world. One group in society has the power to create money at no cost to itself, while the citizens have to work to earn it. It's therefore inevitable that this group has disproportionate power and influence within society. If you want to know why governments have grown so large and bloated, you only have to look as far as the fiat money systems and the power they give to those governments. That money gets spent on all sorts of things a country needs. Whether you agree with how the money is spent or not, it's irrelevant. The fact is, it centralizes power in government and the state. Bitcoin changes this dynamic because Bitcoin makes it impossible for the government to print more or debase Bitcoin for their own political agendas, as we are currently seeing with the fiat currency system the world over. Money, therefore, remains money. It cannot be hijacked as a political tool. Number 2. Bitcoin preserves the value of people's money. We tend to see high Bitcoin use in countries that have seen the greatest destruction to their national currencies. Turkey, Venezuela, Argentina have all seen massive debasement of their national currencies through money printing. Bitcoin has provided citizens with a way to preserve the buying power of their money. But these countries are not alone. Many countries in the world are playing the money printing game, and that's one of the reasons Bitcoin is so promising long term. 